Hello, 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 hello. It's me. Welcome back to my channel. Okay, so I've got on Sheen Hall today. Bit of a sheen hole, bit of a sheen hole. Oh yeah. Do you know what? I'm sure you're saying I needed to tell you lot. There was, and do you think I can think can I remember what it was? Brain fog. That's what it is. Brain fog. I'm getting brain fog. My friend reckons that when you go through menopause you get brain fog. Dunno if this is true or if this is false. This bit of hair's annoying me. Oh, my hair always annoys me. Honestly, it gets right on my fruit knees. <laughs> Anyhow, oh, how are you all been? Have you missed me? You better say you've missed me, all right? Otherwise, we're going to fall out. Yeah, um, I've not been up to much to be quite honest. I've just been doing the usual. I mean, I've not had the best of, of days, um, but I've been doing me ass work and more housework and well more housework because that's all i do um i've not done too much i did go cambridge so i've got a tk max haul that i'm gonna do at some point my birds are calling me in again aren't they every time if it don't matter every t do you know what i might have to put my hair up if this carries on this piece of orphan hair flying away there Oh, God, blimey, now I've got a little olive from on the buses. Oh, Arthur! Just need me specs. Hey, where are they? I'll do me olive impersonation. Where's me specs? Where are they gone? Where are they gone? <sighs> Looks like I won't be doing me olive impersonation. I've lost me specs. One minute. Fandom under all me rubble, didn't I? <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so uh, yeah, I've got a few bits to show you. Um, but before I do, you know that time of day. I said, you come on, girls. You know the time of day. Faster. I said, you know the time of day. You know the time of day. Yeah, and there was one of my subscribers who said something to me, and I wanted to tell you something specifically. And for the life of me, I can't remember which one it was and what it was. I told you, brain fog. Please excuse me, my brain fogness. All right. Anyhow, any yo, I'm gonna do one joke for you, say, because I told you I'm running out of jokes. All right. I need to get some more. I might do it later on, actually. Little Red Riding Hood walks all alone through the deep, dark woods. Suddenly, I'm gonna start that again. I'm gonna do it dramatically. Are you ready? Little Red Riding Hood walks alone through. No, I'm gonna start that again. <laughs> I want it to sound really good, do you know what I mean? Little Red Riding Hood walks all alone through the deep, dark woods. Suddenly, she hears rustling in a thick bush. Cautiously, she moves the branches aside and finds herself facing the big, bad wolf. Oh, big bad wolf, why do you have such red eyes? Go away, I'm crapping! Do you like that one? You better. <laughs> little things, please, little minds, as they say. I liked that one, I'd sell ya. I'd have found a few more like that. I liked it. I don't care what you say, I liked it, alright? Anyway, you also do know that time of day. You know that time it's time for my 1,227 facts that you wish was now ending. But it's not. We've got all this to go, people. All of this. Let's just hope I'm on the channel for that long, huh? Because mm. you never know, I might wake up one day and think, I just can't do this anymore. It's not making me feel better. And I've not got enough subscribers and I can't do it. I mean, I'm very much doubting it, but you know, I could. You know, I could. Anyhow, anywho, the technology behind smartphones relies on up to 250,000 separate patents. 
don't get it, so it don't matter. The human brain takes in 11 million bits of information every second, but is only aware of 40. I don't think in this brain it's even aware of only 40. I'm thick as two short planks, I tell you. The human brain takes in 11 million bits of information. I reckon my brain does take in a lot of information. It just don't store it. It just sort of goes like that. Or in one ear and out the other. Do you know what I mean? The water in a blue whale's mouth weighs as much as its entire body. Oh my God. That is a load of cross to tea. I'd never thought that. I love blue whales, aren't they beautiful? I'd like to swim with one. I don't know if I would be brave enough. Would I be brave enough? Yeah, I'd be brave enough. Or would I? I don't know. I'm contemplating. This side of my brain's saying, do it, Lise. And this side's saying, think rationally, Lise. And my mouth's got air in it. Brilliant. The ancient Romans discovered parrots could speak and taught them to say, Hail Caesar. When they got bored with this, they took to eating them instead. Isn't that funny, though? I was just talking about Planet of the Apes, and his name was Caesar, and now they're talking about Caesar in my 1,227 facts to blow your socks off. That... It's conspiracy, it's not obviously, it's not really. <laughs> I just find that a bit bizarre. What is it, coincidental? Um, so the ancient Romans discovered parrots could speak and taught them to say, how Caesar. But when they got bored of it, they took to eating them instead. Yeah, brilliant, brilliant. That's just like, I mean, my birds can't talk anyway. They just, wah, wah, wah. they could if they wanted, they choose not to. But could you imagine if my birds did talk and then I got fed up and thought oh, do you know what I just think I'm going to chuck them in the ninjas day I fancy a bit of green parrot who does that what kind of barbarians were they sorry if there's any Romans watching this I mean I very much doubt it but if there is I find that barbaric and I'll tell you to see your face you know what you see is what you get all right whether you like me or whether you don't <laughs> So that's my 1,227 facts to blow your socks off. Did you like that? You better. Anyway, I'm going to get on with me all, all right? So, I've got a few bits from shit. Actually, before I do get on, do you know what? Oh, sorry. I'm putting the old barnet to the side, all right? Because it's getting right on my wick. Right on it, all right? Put that in there. What do you reckon? It'll do. Right, so, I've got a sheen haul, but before I show you that, uh, I did show a little picture. Um, look what Callie's friend brought me back from Morocco, bless her. I mean, obviously, it's a replica. We know that. Um, but, oh, look. How cute is that? Bless her heart. She's so sweet. I was like, mm. yeah, so she bought me that and I got it yesterday. So that's from her, my little second daughter. She calls me her second mum. Anyway, I got, like I say, I've got a sheen haul, I have, but there is uh, one other thing from somewhere else. So down in good old Arlo, there is a um, a choice. A choice is like, uh, knock, not knockoffs, that's not the word I'm looking for. No, like stuff from Next that maybe they've got an overbash of too much of, or maybe it didn't sell, or maybe it's out of season, or whatever. Anyway, I see these glasses, sunglasses, and they was up for four quid. And I thought, oh, you know, I don't know. Not too bad, I suppose. But when I tried them on, I liked them. Have a look. <laughs> hang on, hang on. Hang on, you can't get the full effect, all right? I'm taking that off. <laughs> I'm hoping it's making me look better, all right? What do you reckon? Dynasty, eat your heart out? Well, when I see them, I was like, I like them. I thought I'm either going to look like Ray Charles or I'm going to like them, and I like them. But anyway, when I took them to the till, 74p they'd gone down to. Or was it 75, 75p, sorry? 75p. 75p! You know what I said, didn't you? I'm getting them, I am, and I did. So I got them. Come on, you can't go wrong, can you? Anyway, now I'm going to get onto machine bits. Oh, by the way, now you can try these codes, guys. I don't know 
if they work for you, um, because they sent them in the packages, but I've got a couple of codes here, so it can get you 15% off of all orders. Um, oh, I suppose it will work for you, So, because it's on both of them. So if you go on Sheen and you want 15% off, when you go to pay at the end, put in this code, TSX15. You probably can't see it properly, but it says TSX15. And they sent them to me, so obviously, I suppose anyone can use them. I mean, I, I, I don't, I suppose they were specifically for me, because I ordered off there, but I bet anyone can use them. I would say just try it anyway, do you know what I mean? So anyway, let me show you the bits I got from Sheen. So I went on there, and because you know what, I told you, with Sheen, right, they're crafty. Crafty is a wagon load of monkeys, they are. What they do, they will give you um, money off. So they'll say, oh, if you buy, like, go in and you've got vouchers, 30% off, 15% off. la di da di da So, uh, yeah, so because of that, then you go on there and you're like, do I really need it? Oh, I don't really need it. But do I want it? Hell yeah, I do. And then you, there you go. You're, you're buying, aren't you? Before you know it, you're like, oh, oh, I'm broke. Shane, sending me to bankruptcy, I tell you. Anyhow, so I'll show you a couple of bits that I got. First of all, I see these flip flops and I really liked them. And when they come through, I was over the moon because when I say they are like walking on air, I, I kid you not, they are like walking on air. How beautiful are them flip-flops with the roses on? Shabby chic flip-flops. Don't you think I'm taking the shabby chic a little bit too far now though? Even having it on my gums. Who cares? I like shabby chic. So yeah, and like I say, so comfy. And they were... Uh, six pounds I think but obviously with the voucher it shows you what they will be and I think I got them for about four pounds eight P um, and they did get have them in other colours I think they had pink um, what other colours pink I need to see the pink and the red but I do think there was like maybe like purples or I don't know but anyway if anyone is interested like I say you know I'm not very good writing all the slinks and that malarkey but if you are I'll try and find a way to uh, do it so yeah so that's the first thing I got then I see these and I thought I like these. You know, sometimes when I'm looking really ugly, like now, I can put these on. These are £1.87 and they make me look a bit suffice. Do you know what I mean? I'm leaving them on for duration. Yeah, so I've got these. They've got like a blue glare to them, I can see. Oh. I knew that was there. Can you see that air? I feel it flapping in my lips, on my big old lips. Yeah, so I got them. Did I say they were £1.87? I think they were £1.87. Which ain't bad, do you know what I mean? I would like real lenses put in here, but the optician I don't think would do them because they're quite flimsy, do you know what I mean? But they're all right just to put on, to, you know, try and look sophisticated, like a, a secretary or something like that, you know. Um. Anyway, then... Excuse me. Then I got another one of these. Now, you know I've got the pink one, the Statue of Liberty headbands. That's what I call them, because that's what they look like. But I quite like them. I do. So, there is a black one. Should put it on. I look like a nut job, don't I? Go on, admit it to me. I look like I am. I'm nutty, and I, I think I look nutty sometimes. Keeping that on, alright. I'm keeping it on because it's keeping this barnet out of me face. Out of me face. There you go. What's a nutter? There you go. But anyway, anyhow, anyhow, swiftly moving on. I said, swiftly moving on. So I got that. Then I got another one, didn't I? In white. I know you're probably thinking, what? Do you want every colour? Yeah, I do. And this one has got the. So there's the white one. Knowing me, that's how I'll wear them. I'll wear them together. No, I won't really. Um, 
so there's the white one. And these are... Do you know what? I can't remember if it was just under £2 or just over £2, but they're in the bounce, all right? And that one's got these with it. And thank you to some of my lovely subscribers because I didn't know what they were. Uh, and a few people have enlightened me that what they are for is you put them on your wrists, like so, and when you're washing, so say if, like, if you've got your fake, <coughs> excuse me, fake tan on, when you're washing, it will, the, the water will run onto there, but it won't run your fake tan and that. So, yeah. So, it comes with two of them. Uh, yeah. I think I might put the white one, though, back in here. Because I'll get worried. If one things are white, do you ever worry about them getting dirty? Like, they're not going to get dirty in my place. That's, not, that's never going to happen, but... You know when you think, oh, I don't know, it's just my brain. You know my brain, don't you? You know what, how it works. Um. Anyway, and then I bought quite a few pet. Hang on a minute. I am missing. No, I'm not. There they are. I thought I was missing a few bits and bobs, but I'm not. So, anyway, then I bought some earrings. So, let's put these ones, or show you, should I say. I loved the colour. And I quite like earrings from Sheen. They're all really cheap. They're all like £100. So these are like little blue glittery ones. And I know I shop at Ming. Because I haven't put earrings in today. Get in the hole. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Anything that glitters I like. I told you I'm like a little magpie. What do you reckon? Do you like them, peeps? Do you like them? I oh, do. I'm an accessory girl. I am an accessory girl. Hmm. Oh, I've got some funny stories to tell you as well. But I won't tell them to you today. You're going to have to wait. <laughs> Anyhow, then I bought these. If I can get into them. Hang about. Hang about. Hang about. Why am I licking it? Like, that's going to make me get into it quicker. So these are pearl earrings. Oh, they are wonderful. Look at them. I like them. Look how long they are. I don't know if you can see properly. Let me put the other side. Oh, I really like them. They are a bit of me. Because I like how long they are. I do like things that are big. I've told you that before. <laughs> Pity I don't get it though, huh? Right, I'll put that over to that side. Why have I got lipstick on there? I don't know. Bit of rubbish on the floor. On the deck. Uh, and then I got these. Oh, these look smaller, actually, than what they did. Do you know what? Sometimes like, you can't really tell the proper size of things. That's the only thing. With Sheen, you're best to go down onto the comment section. See if anyone else has bought them. And then they should put... You know, some of them put pictures so you can see like the actual size of them. Because they are a little bit small. They'd go nice with this top I've got on, though, wouldn't they? Look. Why just so do these. Nice. But smaller than I would have liked. So having said that, they're not far off the ones I've got on, really. So, yeah. Lovely colour. I do love orange. So I've got them. Uh, and then I see these little wooden ones. And like I say, these are all like under a pound or just over a pound. You know me. I don't ever really know the prices. I'm a nightmare. Don't ask me. I just don't remember half the time. Uh, and these are like, oh, these would go for what I've got on as well. I must have known I was wearing this top. So they're like little wooden ones. Very nice and lightweight. Nice and lightweight they are. I don't feel like you've got any there's nothing worse i think nothing worse than you know sometimes you, you, i've got some beautiful earrings in there but within within like maybe a minute or so of wearing them i feel like i'm being so weighed down and you start getting a headache you know you're like oh give me the paracetamol because your head's hurting so much um yeah and i don't like that obviously i mean who does don't solves. uh next thing so i thought these were so cute so I thought I'm getting them. I am. And I did. <laughs> They're little hearts, look. I don't usually wear things. Like... Hey. 
That one's a little bit on the bent side. Oh, aren't they cute? Look, little hearts. And I think these were about 85p, if I remember rightly. I know they were really bare cheap. All right, that's how the kids talk, isn't it? That is bare cheap. That's sick, man. Do you know what I mean? That is bare cheap, bruv. Can't fun. <laughs> I'm gonna be one of the. I'm gonna be one of them on out on the street there. Like, all right, fam, how you doing, mate? All right, fam, all right, cuz. They'd be like, shut up, you fool. <laughs> shut up, you fool. Oh, I'm only trying to, you know, be in with the in crowd. <laughs> Just wouldn't work. Yeah, so I got them. Um, and then I've got another. Put, see, like what I've got on here. Uh, I got exactly the same, but these ones are gold. Like a gold. Look, they're like all cool showers, then, girl. Nice, aren't they? So I've got them, and like I say, I've said to you a zillion, a quillion times, they're pounds or just over. Nothing will be much more than that. Uh, and then the last pair of earrings I've got are these pink ones. Again, they're wooden ones, so they're nice and lightweight. And they are big. They're what I like. That's the size I kind of like. This big size. And they're really nice. They're like a hot pink. If you're watching this pen, Penny, I bet they'll go nice with that cardigan you bought. The one from, where was it from? Pep and Co, wasn't it? Yeah, look, see, I need to go and get on them cardigans. Yeah, I like that. I like them, I do. So, uh, that's my earrings. Then I see these and I thought these were really good. So you get two caps for six pounds but obviously they weren't six pounds because once you get the voucher it popped down to about four four pounds 63 or something like that so i've got a white one which i'll try it on show you i just don't want to get makeup all over it but you know what it is what it is let's take that out hang on one minute all right so here's the white one That's the white one. It's got like all little uh, little diamonds on. State of the barn it. Checking there's no makeup on it. Uh, and then I got the black one as well. The black one, you can see the diamonds though so much more. Oh, blimey. It's because I didn't sort the back out. I mean, I, I haven't got a big head to be fair, but that was <laughs> the smallest. What do you reckon? Nice. Yeah. So I got them two hats. Um, and then I put my glasses back on. The ones that make me look a bit better. <laughs> uh, and then last but not least, when I see this, I was like, do you know what? I've got to get it. I have got to get it. Um, and I'm so obsessed with it. I've not used it yet. In your career, you'll be like, well, how are you obsessed with it? Because I am, because I know how well it's going to work and I know it's going to be a life changer for me, especially as this is how bad I am with my OCD as well. There are certain things I can't do. Now, my toilet is cleaned, what's the word? Is it profusely? I don't think that is the word. But anyway, let's just say it's cleaned. <sighs> It's probably cleaner than some people's dinner tables, and that is not a joke, right? And you can say, but you do a Tom Tit down there, yeah, I do. But once it's been done, <laughs> it's mega cleaned every single time. It's never just left there, do you know what I mean? There's never skiddos down Marlow. Um, but, uh, like, you know what you put in the plastic thing? That, I don't know what they're called. Like, I always say, I always call them toilet cleaners, but they're not like lube blocks. Lube blocks. I'm sure that's what they're called, lube blocks. My lube block, I don't know what it is, but when it's finished, when it's done, so when I'm ready to put the new one on, 
I have to get someone else to take it out of the toilet. I can't do it. I just don't ask me why. But I heave and I actually can bring up sick. There's something in my crazy OCD brain that will not allow me, even though it's down the cleanest of toilets, I clean it all the time. Um, and only I use this toilet. Having said that, Callie does sometimes come in, but other than that, I only use this toilet, all right? Um, and I still can't. I'm, if I go, I'm, I just can't. Even I just can't. Even just the thought of it. I don't know why. Some of like I say, very OCD is very complex, and our brains are very complex, and it's just certain things I can do, and certain things I just can't do. Now, I, and that's one of them. But anyway, I see this, and I was like, "Ooh, ingenious." The box is a bit mash, to be fair, but who cares? As long as the product's fine, which it is, we're all right. Anyway, so what it is... Oh, oh, actually, sorry, I've got these as well. I've given Callie some. So these were about 82p. There's purple, the lavender scent. And then this is meant to be like an ocean scent. Now, what they are, they're little bits of paper. Let me show you one so you can get the idea. They're little bits of paper like this, yeah, if you can see. But what they do, yeah, you chuck one down your loo once you've cleaned it and it just all goes transparent, so after a while you can't see it. But what it does, it sat... Uh, this one smells pretty nice of lavender, but I don't like the blue smell. The blue one doesn't smell good, but it just sanitises, meant to sanitise your loo. I mean, I don't know. I don't like the smell of the blue one. The blue one's rank. No, I don't like the smell of the blue one. But that's the blue one. Same thing. So you just chuck it down the loo and it sanitises your loo. And it's meant to give off a nice smell as well. It doesn't. But at the end of the day, it does sanitise your loo. So I've got them. But anyway, this is my ingenious thing. Right. So, oh, hang on a minute, hang on a minute, folks. Right, so it comes like this, like so, and this goes in now. Now, there is an attachment on it that you can fit it to the wall or whatever. I, I wouldn't personally do that. It's quite long, the stick, look. But what you do, so it's time to clean the bog. So you go, ooh. Let's get me stick. Let's open up this. Right, if you press this button at the end here, all right, watch. This thing comes out. You put it inside here and you clip it onto one of these. I'll tell you, I'm in love. Ingenious. With this one here, what you can do, you will start off to so spray a bit of uh, flash or whatever you want around your toilet. In fact, I am going to do a cleaning of my bathroom and I'm going to show you how I'm going to use this, yeah? So to start off with, I'm going to clean all around the toilet. So that would be all around the, the, obviously the lid, the top, the back bit, down the front, down the sides, everywhere. Then you clean all around the top bit, underneath, inside. And then lastly, you clean in the loo with it, yeah? And when you finish with it, you go like that, hang on, no you don't, you go like that and you pop it in the bin and it's disposable. Genius, I'm, I don't care, that is ingenious. No more germs, so like a toilet brush, no more getting, you know, your toilet brush. And I mean, I bleach my toilet brush, I don't know about anyone else, I put, once I've used it every day, before I put it back, I put bleach on the actual brush and bleach inside the the thing it sits in. But this, I tell you, look at that. And then disposable, like that. Oh, I tell you, it's ingenious. So I've I've just ordered some. Uh, I've not used it yet, obviously, um, but I've ordered some refills because I want to fill this right up uh, because I've got a feeling this is going to be getting. A hell of a lot of use but I wanted to show you lot first before I use it so yeah so that is um, I'm in love 
I'm in love. So that's that. It can now go in my loo. Don't have to go back in that box. And lastly, before I go, I bought these. Um, these are 80... I think it's about 83p. Something like that. And I think they are so pretty. And um, this is what they do. Look, let me show you. You're going to be impressed. One, two, three. So what they do, I'm not going to show you on my foot because I can't lift my foot up. But when you're doing your toenails, so, look. You know, like, to stop them from... I can't show you properly. Oh, I can't show you properly. But they of the Emmys in there. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Um, they're just to put in between your toes, so your toes obviously don't uh touch each other and get the nail varnish on. But I thought, God, they pretty. Yeah, you know I like my bling, so I got them as well. So yeah. <laughs> um, so like I say, what I'm going to do, oh, I've got this, uh, I've got this, this new piece of equipment, all right? So what you do, you put your phone in here, and it's kind of like, uh, I need to a strap-on, family friendly. <laughs> it is a strap-on, essentially, but it straps on your body, like a body strap, and then this bit clips in here, like so, clipping, there you go. And then you wear it like a harness. That's the word. That's the word I was looking for, harness. Um, and then your phone goes on the front. So what I can do, I can try and do my cleaning and a few bits and bobs. So I am going to do a few different videos. In fact, I've got quite a lot of different content I'm going to be doing. So I'm going to be doing some cleaning videos. Uh, I've got one of these for my head as well. But when I tried it on, it gave me a headache. So I can't use that one. Uh, I'm going to be doing some cleaning videos with some of my Sheen products. Uh, I'm going to be doing some more cooking videos. I've got some more uh, photo videos to do and the story about Callie that I've got to do. Um, I've also got a story and some photos I want to show you about a friend of mine called Helen from years ago. Um, so uh, there's a hell of a lot coming up on the channel and, and I'm going to be trying some different things. I might do some ASMRs, but what I mean by that, I might do cleaning. I might do some cleaning where I'm talking and then I might do some cleaning and that where I'm not talking because some people find it therapeutic uh, to just listen to the washing up or the, you know, the cleaning or, or whatever. And sometimes you don't want to listen to this. I mean, I've been rabbiting on 32 minutes. Um, pardon me, I'm burping. I've not even anything. Um, so, yeah, as I say, um, if this is your kind of thing, uh, please hit the like. Please subscribe to my channel. It will mean a hell of a lot to me. And uh, press the notification bell because it will tell you every time that I upload. Thank you to all my new subscribers. Um, I'm really pleased. I think I'm about five... I think about 570 now, something like that. I'm really happy um, with that. It's amazing. And thank you to all my old existing subscribers who all... I mean, you, you're all so wonderful. You text me all the time, you know, comment on my stuff. And you're all so nice to me. Always say so nice things to me, nice things to Callie. Um, so, yeah, it's really nice. It's. I mean, if, you, if I didn't have that kind of feedback, I wouldn't do it. There would be no point. But because you're all so lovely, I'm going to carry on continually you know continually doing it and i'd just like to say one of my subscribers jackie um you are a lovely lovely wonderful wonderful person and you're always saying such lovely things to me and you wrote something the other day and i was like honestly i was like bless you i mean you said um sometimes when you're doing things or think that you think what would lisa and callie do and i was like oh that's so nice uh, yeah, I, I thought it was really, really nice because I know it's hard. I know life is hard. And like I say, I sit on here and I do this and people will probably say, well, Lisa, are you trying to say this isn't you? No, it is me. This is me. And I try and be happy and I try and say, but sometimes on days I'm not feeling well, this is a bit of an alter ego. I'm not going to lie. Um, because... I could sit in front of this camera and I could be like, oh, so much pain or I've got a bad day. And then the camera comes on. I'm like, oh, hey, guys. And um, because I get a joy out of it while I'm doing it, 
it takes my mind off of bad things to do with my OCD and other bad things that I've got going on. It takes my mind off of it. And you lot, in turn, help me. Uh, you know what I mean? Some, some of you have said to me, you help me. And I'm like, you don't realise you help me. Because if you didn't watch it and I didn't have subscribe, there wouldn't be any point. There would not be any point to me doing what I do if I was just sitting there and no one was commenting or I didn't have any subscribers. There would be no point. I might as well just sit here and talk to myself. So I just want to say a big thank you to everyone because as much as you say that I help you, you help me. And if you ever need any advice on anything, I think I'm a pretty good person to give advice. You've got my email or you can, if you, you know, if you don't want people, other people to read it, you can email me. Um, I have got an Instagram, Lisa Riggs 2023. You can go over to there, add me on Instagram. Um, and you know, you can message me on there. I've spoke to a few people on there actually. Um, or if you ever need a chat, you can send me voice notes on there. I've had a few people do that as well. Um, yeah, so that's all I want to say for now. And I love you all very much and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.